when Peter and John came to the man at Get Beautiful, he said, silver and gold I do not have. He said, but such as I have, give I unto you. Listen to me. I don't mean to be arrogant, but let me tell you this. When it has to do with the supernatural, I know what I'm saying. I have enjoyed the message of God even on this wise. I know what a supernatural life will do to you. Your ministry, your business, your life. It is Jesus we are looking up to, but it is men that he uses. I'd like you to open your heart in the next two or three minutes. Believe with your heart. Just help those under the anointing. I have had many encounters in my life. I've only said a few of them. It is on the authority of scripture, the ministry of the Holy Spirit, and the privilege of these encounters. I myself have been a recipient of the graces of those that have gone ahead. It is not everything that has come just directly by my own personal encounter. We have met many people there are those who have gone ahead even in ministry there are those who have demonstrated a supernatural life though we are few we're surrounded by many who have crossed that river before we are not the first you are not the first to do supernatural business John D. Rockefeller. These are men and women who encountered grace. You're not the first to do supernatural ministry. Oh dear. Scripture and history is full of men and women who shook the earth in their lifetime. You're not the first to have a supernatural career. Ask Daniel through the reign of four kings. He remained on top regardless who was in power he remained on top there was a grace and they said an excellent spirit not an excellent talent an excellent spirit was at work in him you're not the first to be intellectually supported by the Spirit of God there were Hebrew boys who were ten times better ten times better let me pray for you now Father, let this grace come upon your people. Let everyone under the sound of my voice, by the privilege of this grace, by the, the ministry of this angel of the Lord's presence, I stretch my hands in the name of Jesus, that everyone under the sound of my voice, at the count of three, may this grace come upon you. May it follow you. May it produce results. One, two, three. Take that grace now. Take that grace now. Take that grace in business. Supernatural business. Supernatural ministry. Kaparos Ketegetebata. Signs. Signs and wonders. In the name of Jesus. Let those that have heard that to rakatos kete prekete kata. I command those gates be open here and tita. In the name of Jesus Christ, be open here and tita. In the name of Jesus Christ, hear me. In the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening, in the night, manifest the supernatural. For many of you who are in ministry here, I anoint you. Go back to your pulpit. Let fire begin to fall upon your altars in unusual proportions. In the name of Jesus Christ. Everything that has been happening in your life by a natural sequence 
we place grace upon it and we command in the name of Jesus quantum leaps geometric proportions of results where you have been praying naturally I place grace upon you may your ministry of prayer step into a supernatural dimension may your ministry of word study step into a supernatural dimension there are many of you here god has called you into the healing ministry but as it is you have not really seen that dimension the tangibility of the healing oil it has not come upon you i open this jar in the realm of the spirit and in the name of jesus like samuel unto david i place that oil upon you receive that grace now young and old man of god woman of god prophet apostle pastor intercessor receive that grace i release you into a strange healing ministry in the name of jesus We have a financial series coming but let me pray over your finances can i be sincere with you there is such a thing called supernatural finances there really is such a thing the mystery of the raven that brings bread for elijah at brook cherry the mystery of the five loaves and two fish that can feed five thousand there is supernatural finances in the name of jesus i stretch my hands from today in the name of jesus i measure a thousand cubits by grace i push you into a deeper level of supernatural finances provide value at a supernatural dimension in the name of jesus christ one last prayer for many of you you have been making progress but the progress is too slow relative to your destiny in the name of jesus just help those under the anointing my goodness hear me wherever you should have been but because you did not have the supernatural advantage you have not arrived there yet i stand by the rod of the prophetic in the name of jesus between now and the end of september please hear me i stand as touching the god of my covenant go forward go forward i push you by prophecy in the name of jesus christ help them please go forward in the name of jesus christ go forward go forward go forward in your career go forward in business go forward in ministry go forward can I be sincere with you? This is the church of the Lord Jesus Christ. One of the indices that measure fulfillment is progress. I pray for you again. Whatever has made the pace of your acceleration slow, the same grace that came upon Elijah and made him to run and overtake the chariots of Ahab, may that grace come upon you right now. And every force that will want to fight this prophecy in the name of Jesus by the privilege of God's grace he has given us the key of David the key that opens a door that no man can shut 
and can shut a door that no man can open we open that door and it remains open day and night we open that door it remains open day and night by the mystery of the key of david that door will never be shut day or night in the name of jesus thank you jesus wave your hands to jesus as an act of worship let's wave your hands to the king of kings thank you thank you jesus for changing my level thank you for giving me a new story remember thanksgiving is the last digit to the faith equation lord we thank you we wave our hands in worship thanking you indeed it is a good thing to come to the house of the lord hallelujah